everybody welcome back to talk with naya so we have to give an update on the case of shanquella robinson so we made a video before talking about the whole situation with shanquella robinson and how she basically is no longer with us unfortunately after she took a trip to cabo with her friends okay apparently during this trip in cabo shanquella and another friend of hers named Dijanae Jackson got into a fight and it was recorded by another one of the friends right in the bedroom of the villa and Shanquilla Robinson appeared to be naked while these two girls were fighting and unfortunately you know Shanquilla passed away during the fight or shortly after <clears throat> and according to the autopsy she suffered some neck injuries so it really led to her passing away. Now, there's a lot of discrepancy going on with this whole case. So the death certificate said alcohol poisoning, I believe, or the friends definitely told Shanquella's mom that, you know, she passed away from alcohol poisoning. But the mom paid six grand and got her daughter's body back into the States and they got an autopsy and she had some neck and spine injuries. And that's what ultimately led up to her death. They're also trying to figure out a discrepancy with the doctor that was called to the room, you know, because there's there's reports out there that said she passed away, you know, 15 minutes after the whole fight situation. And then there's there's stuff out there saying that the doctor tried to perform CPR to resuscitate her for three hours. So they're like, if she passed away 15 minutes after the fight and everything, how was a doctor there for three hours trying to resuscitate a dead body? Like it, it's just a lot going on. But there is breaking news because prior to this news breaking, the United States, the FBI decided to get involved in this case, being that it happened in, in Mexico. The FBI decided to get involved and there was a um, and there was a warrant out to basically arrest Dejanae Jackson. She's the girl in the video fighting Shanquilla. But now Dejanae Jackson is arrested and it's showing here that she's arrested. She was arrested in the United States. OK, and she was placed in federal custody waiting for her to begin her extradition process to Mexico. OK, so during the night of November 28th, Dejanae Jackson was arrested by Interpol agents. And after a control judge issued an arrest warrant against her for the crime of femicide of Shanquella Robinson, who was murdered on October 29th in the Cabo Villas, okay, in a tourist destination in Mexico. Dijanae Jackson, she was placed in federal custody and she's waiting to begin her extradition process to Mexico, where she'll be formally accused of the femicide of the 25 year old Shanquella Robinson. Now the extradition process took between one and two weeks resulting from the procedure that the Attorney General's Office of Justice carried out in the Attorney General's Office of the Republic and Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Mexico. Now the Attorney General's Office of the State of Baja California sir managed to prove that the woman who appears in the video attacking Shanquella is Dejanae Jackson, okay? So she is in custody. A lot of people are assuming that she is going to start talking and she is going to probably air out the rest of the friends that was on this trip. And honestly, all of those friends that were on that trip with Shanquilla need to be in custody. They need to get, they need to figure out what happened. They need to make sure and prove that these friends set this girl up because all of us on the outside looking in, this looks like a setup. How do you go on a trip with some of your friends and then you don't come back home because they fought yeah, you till you, till you died? You know, it, it doesn't make any sense. It really doesn't make any sense. Why were they fighting? There's rumors out there that said that um, they had stolen Shanquilla's money afterwards. You know, they got the refund for the villa since they didn't stay there the whole time. There, there's a ton of rumors out there. Why did they start fighting? What was the reason? Did they plan it the whole time? Okay, what was the motive behind this? Did they plan it? And if so, the other friends need to be in custody as well. So there should be more to come out about this case, but they do have Dejanae Jackson in custody. So we are getting somewhere, all right? Well, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.